rewrite the following in third form. So let me do its continuation from my previous video. Those are what my previous video. I'm going to uh, make uh, the example slightly difficult than the previous video. So let me write the first question. Okay, so the question is 9 divided by 4x to the power, <coughs> excuse me, to the power negative 3 half. So whenever you want to simplify indices or algebraic expression, it's a good idea to write the numbers in the power form. Well, how can I write 9 as a power? So 9 as a power is 2, 3 to the power 2. And 4 is 2 squared x raised to negative 3 halves. Now the second rule that you have to, or the first, in fact, the, this is the first rule that we are applying. The first rule is when you got an index bracket and index, you multiply the indices. So this is 3 to the power 2 times 3 halves divided by the same app applies here. So here the power of x is 1, the power of 2 is 2. So this three, negative 3 halves, you need to multiply to both the expressions, which is 2 to the power 2 times negative 3 halves times x to the power 1 times negative 3 halves. Okay, so this simplifies. So let's simplify this here. So those who are not sure how to do this on without a calculator. Okay, so let me show, hold on. Uh, let me cancel this. Okay, so let me show it here. Hopefully you can see it. Okay. I can't show it on a calculator, sorry. So, 2 times negative 3 halves is same as you should be able to do without a calculator. So, this is 2 over 1 times negative 3 over 2. So, this is negative 6 over 2, which is 2 to the, sorry, 3 to the power negative 3 over, what is this? <coughs> the same thing, 2 times negative 3 half is going to be 2 to the power negative 3 times x to the power this is going to be negative 3 halves 1 times negative 3 half is negative 3 halves so now you'd apply the rule of negative index if you've got a negative index it goes to the denominator if it's in the numerator it goes to the denominator and if you have a negative index in the denominator it goes up so basically it flips or swaps. So this goes up and this comes down. So this simplifies to 2 cube x to the power 3 half over 3 to the power 3. So this simplifies to, this is 8 times, so let me write this like this. So this is x to the power half raised to 3 divided by 27. So let me slightly scroll up. So what will happen? So this is x to the power half is square root of x. So the simplified form is 8 times square root of x to the power 3 over 27. Just like that. So this is the simplified form in the third form. Okay.